like to recommend is LED lighting. LED lighting is still uh, being developed out, but in terms of conservation, uh, we like to go with uh, CFL bulbs everywhere. Um, and uh, in any kind of new construction, we discourage any kind of the, the tube lighting fluorescence uh, because the, uh, the, the next thing is going to be LEDs. They're going to save a lot of electricity. They're coming along. They're like CFLs were a couple of years ago. They're still um, you know, being developed. Costs are coming down. Thirty to hundred bucks, uh, and uh, although they last a long time and use hardly any energy, that's still very pricey. So what I would recommend on any new construction, what I'm also doing in this garage remodel, is um, is I'm re taking out all my tube uh, fluorescents like these here, uh, and uh, and I'm putting in rows of the old traditional style style screw in uh, sockets. Um, and, and initially, I'm going mostly with CFL. I do have a bunch of uh, LED bulbs. Uh, because I buy them all the time and test for all kinds of bulbs. Um, but anyway, initially I'll be going mainly with CFL bulbs in here, and I'll have the screw-in sockets, which are perfect for the LED. When the LEDs are ready and you know the price is right and everything, uh, I'll be just converting those to LEDs. Uh, so I recommend on all new new construction that you go with all screw-in type uh, lighting. Um, LEDs. Uh, the main issue I have with LEDs right now is the color of the light. Uh, you know, it's very blue in most of them. Some of them are quite green. Um, and it's hard to get a perfect warm white out of them. The warm white ones are even a little too yellow. So uh, they're coming along. Uh, but a good one costs you about 65 bucks right now. Uh, and I do have some in test that I'm trying to see how long they last and see if that 65 bucks really does ROI. Because that's, that's pretty high. And the CFL bulbs right now, um, you know, they're, they're very cheap and they've sort of become the standard. So the CFL bulb, very cost effective, uh, you know, not, not expensive to get into and will still save you a lot of energy. Uh, so one thing I would do is make sure to go around your house, get rid of all the, you know, any of the lighting that's, uh, you know, that's incandescent, old style light bulbs, get rid of it, find a way to get CFL uh, bulbs in there. Uh, and that's compact fluorescent type that are a little screw type bulb. Uh, that's what you want to be using. stay on the power line there. Our systems, put one on your roof. 